Well, hello there! What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? Scythe here bringing you a little bit of the new Revolution map pack. I'll be playing uh, Kill Confirmed on the map Hydro. Uh, I kind of enjoyed playing this. Um, I Really, I took a little bit of a break from Call of Duty, and uh, I took a couple days off just because I was getting a little frustrated because just tired of the same old thing, and I was getting a little bored, and when you get a little bored, you start playing a little awful and so I was, wasn't doing really good as far as like really good gameplay so I thought this would be a good gameplay to uh, give you guys and some of the people that uh, have the PS3 that haven't had a chance to download the new map pack yet. Uh, I'm not a big fan of new map packs. Uh, I haven't been for a long time for Call of Duty. Reason being is I don't think they put as much effort in the new map packs as they do the original maps. Uh, reason being is, you know, there's a lot of spawn issues in the new maps. There's a lot of, uh, uh, just, I don't know, just the maps aren't really made for really good games. And, uh, you know, maybe I'm wrong. You know, maybe a lot of people disagree with me. You know, a lot of people uh, like the new maps. I just, I really don't think that they uh, put as much effort into them. And every time Call of Duty comes out with a new one, it's not just Treyarch, but, you know, Infinity Ward as well, they just don't really put out any real good maps. And, like, I like the design of it, and they, they, f they are fun in the beginning because it's something new and it's something fresh, but after a little while, you start getting a little frustrated with they just really don't focus a whole lot on the spawning and just some of the way the maps figured out. I, I'm not sure if they just don't get enough beta testing or what the case may be, but I mean, I enjoyed this gameplay a little bit. Uh, it wasn't, you know, that amazing. I, I think I got like 62, 63 kills in this game, which I thought was pretty cool. And again, like I said, it, it's kind of good to give the people that have the PS3s, you know, that don't have an Xbox, a little bit of glimpse of what these uh, maps have. And in this game here, Hydro, it, there's just, a, I don't know what these two guys were doing. They were making out or touching each other in special areas. I don't know what they were doing. Um, but, you know, this guy over here, I guess, was meditating. It's a good place to sit there and just kind of think about your thoughts and reflect on everything that happened. And maybe he was pulling a band-aid off his kneecap. I don't know. But it's it's not a bad... This one's not a bad map. Uh, I really don't like the underground little areas because, you know, no matter where you spawn, if there's somebody camping there, it's a really long journey to get back over there. And then they have a lot of time to set up and they have a lot of time to, you know, get their little camp on. And the little buddies can come over there and start, you know, humping their leg and stuff like that. Uh, I did get to use a lot with the the AGR and the Stealth Chopper were really good in this map. So if you guys are really looking for a good couple of kill streaks, uh, I used the Lightning, I used the AGR, and I used the Stealth Chopper. And this, for some reason, with as many indoor areas as this uh, map has, the Stealth Chopper was just a beast. I mean, it was just spawn reaping the Donkey Doo Dog Diddles. Donkey Doo Dog Diddles, by the way, that's a trademarked phrase that I just made. So I hope you guys don't take that and use that as your own. But if you do, it's okay. I'm not going to get upset about it. But it's, it's, it's I don't know. I, again, you know, I've been saying this for a long time. I just think they need a different change besides maps. Uh, you know, the Peacekeeper came out. I'm sorry, I think the Peacekeeper blows. Um, I think they, uh, you know, they did everything they could to make sure the Peacekeeper wasn't overpowered or make sure the Peacekeeper wasn't the most elite gun. They got extra time to nerf it and do whatever they had to with it. So I wasn't, you know, I wasn't impressed with that. So hopefully, you know, my advice is not pay the season pass just so you can get the Peacekeeper. So if you guys were debating it and going, ooh, I'll get the season pass now because I get a free gun, it's not really worth the money for the season pass. It, I mean, it's it's good to have the map packs. I know this is the first of a uh, a few map packs that they're going to release. So it's not something that uh, you know, it's 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 worth the money if you like Call of Duty and it's worth the money if you get bored with the maps, but you will get a little irritated with the new maps after a while just because they don't really work on them too much. Um, maybe this time they'll start, you know, doing some uh, updates on them. I know last time in Black Ops and in Modern Warfare 3, they really didn't do a whole lot of updates on the maps which caused them to be kind of irritating and I don't know about you guys but I turned the new map packs off on Modern Warfare 3 just because of the spawns and just I don't know I just it wasn't a fun time uh, if you guys have been uh, watching you know some other youtubers with the new maps uh, I'm they're getting kind of the same feedback you know it's good to have new map packs but at the same time they're not you know excited about it that's why I really wish they just come out with a new thing and I'm uh, I've really been a uh, really focused on trying to get them to hear uh, Treyarch and uh, Infinity Ward to hear me out on my idea about bullet uh, perks being able to uh, maybe uh, update and upgrade your bullets 
and use that in exchange for maybe a different perk like having a faster bullet rate or having a you know an explosive bullet that may you know once it hits one opponent if there's one next to him maybe it like gives them a lot of boost shock I have no idea why I didn't get that care package and I think it was a good thing I didn't either because I got a good couple kills right here so if you guys think I was ignoring that or I didn't see that care package I did um, I just don't know why I didn't get it and apparently there was somebody behind me because somebody already got the care package pretty quickly and it was that little noodle sucker over there by the way noodle sucker is going to be one of my uh, new things as well so you know there's my first AGR and that little guy just I don't know maybe he kept everyone from staying indoors I don't know what the case may be but it did really good damage and the stealth chopper was awesome uh, by the way the lightning strike on this map I just couldn't figure out because people were camping inside and stuff it's just hard to get any uh good kills and this is nothing the spawn you know if there's people right there that close we're gonna spawn and you're gonna spawn right next to it i really don't think that's awesome so anyway uh you know i hope you guys like this video if you guys could give it a like i mean that would really appreciate it. you guys uh don't know how actually that does help and it really does help oh that guy was pissed i took away his guardian he was not happy he got smurf slapped with my pdw so, anyway, again, if you guys could give this video a like, I really would appreciate it. And if you guys have any uh, feedback on the new maps, uh, you know, it's definitely something I like hearing from you guys. Um, the Battlefield 3 video that I just did earlier this week, you know, you guys gave me some great tips. Um, if you haven't seen that uh, video, it's going to be uh, the video right before this one. And basically, I'm trying to noob it up on uh, Battlefield 3, and I, I, I'm really awful at that game, so I'm actually, uh, I'm doing something that a lot of machinima gamers don't do is play a game you're really bad at it you show you're bad at it and trying to get some of your uh, subscribers to give you some tips because I think it's good that you guys get some input um, and maybe you guys can give me some input on the new maps maybe there's some cool little spots that you guys like uh, just so you know this chopper just rapes and I have no idea why I mean it just goes to town and that guy should have died but yeah, if you guys have any tips on the maps, I mean, I, I welcome all kinds of tips. You know, And again, like I said, you guys gave me some great feedback on the uh, Battlefield 3 video. And once again, if you haven't checked that out, check that out. You know, Let me know. Uh, and especially if you guys... Uh, I, know, I know there's a lot of you that play uh, uh, Battlefield 3 pretty good. I know there's a kid named uh, Cameron who's one of my fans on my fan page who's always saying he plays uh, Battlefield 3. So it's always good to hear from him. Uh, you know, it's, it's great to hear tips from people that aren't just youtubers because there's a lot of good stuff that you guys have and just because you guys don't put videos up doesn't mean that you guys don't have great ideas or great tips and great ideas and i think it's good to hear those and i think it's good that you guys get a chance to say something because i know a lot of youtubers they don't really you know acknowledge uh feedback except hey great video or hey thanks for uh you know doing that video or whatever you know I I wanna hear from you guys you know I wanna hear what you guys have to say um, and if it's bad you know it's bad whatever I know there's people that don't like me and I, I really could give two rats farts in space whether or not you like me or not you know it's you know it's not about you know popularity I'm just having fun putting up these videos I'm having a good time and I hope you guys enjoy them and I hope you guys you know share them with your friends the main thing is if sharing them on Facebook is just so big for me if you guys could do that you know just going on there clicking like or you know sharing uh, the video on your Facebook or your Twitter you know I'm trying to get with you guys on Twitter as much as I can now I wasn't a big Twitter guy so I'm trying to be a more Twitter involved I know that's the thing now so I'm trying to be a little more tweeting or twatting or fly swatting the twatter or whatever you guys want to call it that'd be kind of cool if the if Twitter actually had a button to twat people if somebody you don't like you could just twat them I don't know if that's a good idea or a bad idea but it sounds pretty cool uh, there's another AGR I got going on, another Stealth Chopper. Uh, no, um, these AGRs, I'm sorry, I know but nobody really uses them that much, but I love it because it just annoys people. I don't like controlling it because I think it's fun letting it just kind of go rampant and kind of annoy people. And a lot of people end up killing it, you know, pretty easily, but you do get a couple kills out of the AGR on it, and it does bug the shit out of people. It's like a kill streak that trolls people because it just kind of quietly, like, runs, like, you know, real slow and kind of mopey. So it's kind of like Eeyore or like some sort of depressed donkey with like a machine gun on its back kind of running around, kind of just pissing people off. So 
Uh, the video is coming towards an end here, so again guys, if you could just click that like button, it actually really does help. Um, I got some great stuff coming up with my new gaming setup, I'm going to do some really cool live streams, got some new games I'm going to be putting on here, and it really helps, and Machinima does, you know, love, you know, seeing you guys uh, like our videos, and, you know, showing uh, your support, and I know you guys do a lot to help support this, and I really do appreciate it, and I try to support any other people that have channels on there, and and there's a couple other fans that you know let me know on the Facebook page that they have channels and I try to show them some love so here it is guys you know if you guys haven't seen it yet so a little couple new little scenes here on the new map packs and uh, I'll try to give you guys a couple different of the maps as well and hopefully you guys on PS3 will get the new maps quickly and hope you guys have a great time playing it and hope to hear from you guys and have a great day 62 and 19 you yeah.